Hi everyone, this is Sarah Fezio and I am going to do another pour with the Olympic one with dimethicone. Now I have mixed some white by Artist Loft. I have pink or fuchsia with dimethicone in it. I also put dimethicone in the white, and this is pretty much what I had left over from the other pores. So I'm not sure that might end up looking like a salmon color, but I'm hoping if I pour it enough, some of the colors will separate. So I have my white. I'm just going to pour some of that in there. I still have some in the cup and I have some pink with dimethicone and I'm going to pour some of that in the cup. Hopefully it doesn't end up being all salmon colored and I'm just going to put some of the pink on the corners and it's reacting like that because there is dimethicone in it. It's kind of separating when I, I don't want it to all go off, but that might make it easier when I actually pour so that everything I do get doesn't go straight off the canvas. All right, on this one, what I think I'm gonna do is just pour from the top like so. I'm gonna pour it backwards well, I'm not going to pour it backwards. I'm going to tilt it to the side. I need this to go over the edge. I wanted a lot more pink in this one than what I had in the others. And I'm just going to coat the sides here some. with the pink. All right, once it goes over the edge, I'm happy. Just trying to get something I like. Lots of air bubbles. Now I'm going to torch this. But only in areas where I think I need it. Those are all air bubbles. Lots of air bubbles, but there's some cells down here in the corner, which is kind of nice. Cells here. 
small cells. Those are larger right there. I can see in that ribbon that there's pink underneath, so that's where I'm going to torch. I have lots of cells here. They're not very bright, though. I mean, there's not much contrast in colors. Not very bright. It's not the right word. Okay, so I hope you guys can see all the cells going on in there. They're not air bubbles. Those are actual little cells. The air bubbles pop right away when I first started torching. But really, you're going to have to see it. I mean, I'm going to have to take pictures of close-ups. Take some close-up pictures for you to really see. So these things here... Those are like organic cells. Those are cells that actually form from the density of the paint. <clears throat> the smaller ones are cells that form because I use the dimethicone. All right, so if you have any comments or questions, leave them below. Check the description for the list of materials. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I sure enjoyed doing this. Um, this is part of the Olympic One series. They all kind of look pink and orangey, which is really awesome. One is mainly orange, one has a lot of white in it, and this one has a lot of pink in it. If you'd like to see more videos, please hit the button to subscribe and the gray bell to be notified when I release new videos. I hope you guys have a great evening. Thanks for watching. Lots of love. Bye.